Pepperoni Port with two guys in a pie. We're the two guys, and where is today's pie guy? Today we're going to Odyssey Pizza. It's located on Clear Lake Road in Coco. It's been around since 1842. I, I think it's been around longer than that. I mean, this place is old. I think Ponce de Leon stopped here on his way to St. Augustine. Found the pizza, and he found it to found the youth. Yeah, yeah, it's possible. Oh, wait a minute. Homer's the Odyssey. He got the title for his book based on this place. He named it after it. Well, it is pretty popular. I mean, it is the most requested place for us to go. And it is a local family hangout that uh, has been around since Ponce de Leon or Homer. 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 I, I, I think it was around the creation of time. <laughs> creation of thought. Yeah. So God served the first slice. Uh, sorry about that. Well, that's unless you're one of those Evo people and then it was uh, hey. a dinosaur. A dinosaur. That's fine. Irregardless, um, Odyssey Pizza, we're coming for you. Monkey's Hawaiian version had bananas on instead of pineapple. <laughs> See you there. <laughs> That had to be the worst thing. No, I'm just kidding. It was pretty good. <laughs> As I wrote down in my notes, because yes, I do take notes. I wrote down that is a good old fashioned 70s era filling pizza. Oh my God. We had to sit there for another half hour after we ate. Yeah. It was like <sighs> little, little, little stuff. Not not quite uh, not quite Zarella stuff, but then again, we'll. All right, sorry for that weird edit. We had the camera shut down on us, but we are back. Not like you're even the camera was stuffed. The camera was stuffed. <laughs> uh, that it, okay for those of you that are like our age, because we're older than dirt. We're kind of as old as us. I think I was with Ponce de Leon when he found this place. Yeah. Oh, oh by the way, in 1979. 1979. Yes. <laughs> Anyways, back in those days, the type of pizza you got was exactly what you get here. A pan fr uh, not fried and pan baked pizza yeah. that is reminiscent of a deep dish, but not not as thick as a deep dish. But it's got that similar, you know, nice uh, light, flaky, and, 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 and chewy, crispy uh, the crust. crust. Was nice and uh, it was. Mm. <laughs> I love that crust. That crust was great. The sauce was the great. sauce was awesome. And, and my well, favorite sauce. Yeah, and I'll let you uh, you talk about uh, the cheese. The cheese was awesome. I, you know, I, when you get that pizza, don't ask for extra cheese because no. they're not skimping on the cheese. No, they are not. And, and if you get if you ask for check extra cheese, they're gonna try to talk you out of it. If, if you allow them to talk you, if they, you get it on there and you get this big lump of cheese like you got a cheese sandwich, that's your fault because you do not need extra cheese on that sandwich. You don't need extra pepperoni on that sandwich. Pizza. It's sandwich, a pizza. pizza. A yeah, it's a uh, pizza. <laughs> <laughs> See, guess, this yeah. is how full he is. It's affected his brain. He doesn't you remember know, what he was eating. Dying over here. It was so. Oh my god. It was so awesome. When yeah. I when I, I got the first bite going through and get the first slice of pizza, I was I looked to myself. I said, you know what? I think I'm gonna order another one because there's not enough here for the two of us. Oh, uh, there was enough. Because <laughs> I wanted to eat the whole pizza. I got halfway done. I was halfway through that pizza. I'm like, oh my god. The, the, I've eaten Odyssey pizza for a long time. I've enjoyed this pizza for a long time. 
Um, other guy over here, he's this is the first time he sat there and eat that eating that pizza in the yeah. place. And I think yeah. this is one of my favorite places to get pizza anywhere. Period. Yeah, I'm a little disappointed that I've never been there before yeah. until now because uh, that is definitely a, a pizza and, we're getting. And, and this is also why we're doing this because places like Odyssey Pizza that you don't normally, you know, you you know, you live in Rockledge, it's only you know what, five miles from your house, and you've yeah, never yeah. tried it. So we want people to try these places that we go and enjoy. Like we went to some places that we've never been before, and we've had amazing experiences. Mm -hmm. And so we want to bring those experiences to you. But today is about Odyssey. And Odyssey checked all the boxes for me. A great crust, great sauce. I love my sauce, and this is the best sauce. Plenty of pepperoni. Uh, plenty of pepperoni. They don't skimp. You can see some of the before and after pictures. Kurt allowed us to take the pictures um, before when he put it in the oven and after it came out of the oven. Uh, the, the pepperoni is delicious. The cheese is amazing. Um, for those of you who like the cheese, me to say cheese, 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 cheese. Cheese! Yeah. <laughs> pepperoni has a little bit of that, that, that wood fire taste. It's a uh, baked into it when whenever the pepperoni's made. It's a really good, nice flavor of pepperoni. I, I do have a complaint. Um, what, what and it, complaint? It, it, the complaint is so ridiculous, it's not even funny. It's messy because it's such a nice pizza and it's so, it, when you cut it, the cheese wants to go crazy, the sauce wants to go crazy. You got to really, you know, you almost have to eat it with a knife and fork. But I gotta tell you, I'll take the extra napkins to eat this thing. It's, I'll eat it. I can eat Odyssey pizza every day. Yeah, early on, you need that knife and fork. But as it as it cools down, this is one of those pizzas that actually gets better because everything kind of congeals together, like all the, the crust and the sauce and the cheese, all kind of works in a nice solid pie that is <laughs> very uh, finger friendly at that point. It, early on, it's not finger friendly. Uh, you got sauce and cheese and, and nuclear waste dripping all over you. Well, not nuclear waste. It just seems like nuclear waste because <laughs> it's so hot at the time. Um, it is hot. Comes out piping yeah. hot, that's for sure. Now, they don't just sell pizza, so you get an opportunity to try some other, other things on the on the menu. By, by all means, try it. I, they have great subs. I've had them. They have great salads. They have great product there. Everything that Kurt and his staff does um, is, is amazing. Um, oh, we're forgetting something. What are we forgetting? We're forgetting the rating. Or what do you give Iliad and the Odyssey, Homer's great epic pizza place? Oh, the Odyssey pizza or the Homer, the, 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 the Odyssey? Well, Homer's kind of a, a masterwork classic, so we already know what that is. But okay. What do you give Odyssey pizza? Odyssey pizza. I gotta really think about this. I give it a five. Five rating. There you have it. There you have it. I, can't, I got nothing for a five. I can't do a four like the golf score thing. And, and so it's just five. Five. Okay. Five alive. Okay. No five dollar foot long. <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's a piece of worth getting. Yeah. Um, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you like, share, comment. Let us know where you want us to go next. Subscribe. We always need subscribers. Works out for YouTube because you can see the next video as it comes yep. up because we put these out every two weeks. Um, and uh, that finishes it off. So, loving pizza slices. <laughs>